Hey guys, welcome back to another video. This is Jazz Hands. No gloves this time because I'm going to try and... I really wanted to do a skipper video and to do the skipper video I kind of... For my like purposes of my uh, video setup is I really need to set up the skipper dream room for the background so that you can actually see what the heck she would look like back in 1964 when she came out. Um, it is a ton of work to set this thing up. It, it has so many parts, and I thought I'd just make one big stinking video to show you guys how complicated it is to set up and everything that comes with it. It is just crazy, everything that comes with this thing. And it's also really difficult, too, I find. Uh, but let's uh, set it up and get it all going. Hopefully I don't appear on video in any way. Since I am trying to be fairly anonymous in the videos. So one thing that I need to do is I'm buying, I'm going to buy some book binding paste to like bind together the parts that are ripped and broken on here. I haven't done it yet because I kind of went over budget <laughs> buying Barbie stuff in preparation for my videos. So I've had to uh, kind of slow down a bit and take my time, which is fine. It's, it's still fun to play. I think I'm missing a piece, and that's why this is kind of uh, bowing out on this side, but that's all right. But this thing is just freaking huge. It is so big. Like, this is just my coffee table, and it's going to take up the entire stinking coffee table. Oh, man, I did it. <laughs> you can actually see the whole thing, right? Kind of. Dowel rod for the curtains. This is the floorboard. I think. There we go. Fits down there. See, this is supposed to go all the way up in the back, like so, but it's bowing out too much. It's all right. We're getting the idea, right? Here, I'll focus on the area that I'm going to work on first, which is this back corner. So it is going to be a bit of a wobbly video just because, I don't know, the setup is not that great. I, ha I, I can't put this in my shadow box, so the lighting's not going to be that good, and the audio's probably not going to be that great. But, you know, we'll, per we'll persevere. <laughs> we'll make it through this. comes with a lamp. I love this chair. Vanity. Put that in there. I'll do that later, I guess, when everybody can see what's going on. Here, I'll just move this briefly so you can see the other part. Because I said I was going to work on one side, and then I went to the other. There, we'll just kind of turn you guys around. We'll open the closet, which has all the other pieces stored in it. One of which I actually have to glue together again because it is broken, broken, broken. This piece right here is broken, so we're gonna leave that inside, leave that inside, take out this piece, and the other pieces of the broken one. So that's the closet. I'm missing the little door handles that go on it right here. That's like the only piece that's actually missing from this set though, which is kind of incredible. It's part of the reason why it was so expensive too. Push that up, that's the vanity shelf. And then the actual vanity piece goes inside right there. Like this is quite <laughs> a production to get this thing all set up. I don't know how little girls manage to do it. And the corner, go back to her little alcove chair. I'm going to move you guys back so that the light's not in the way, or the stand is not in the way. Good heavens. Is that? Oh, this needs to get put up. I have to get the thing out for that. I thought I, thought I had everything, but I don't. This piece is going to have to get glued. Just checking to see if my face is going to be on camera because I'll have to redo the video if it is. And that would not be fun. 
There we go. So she can play a game on there. That's a really cute little uh, board game of some kind. It's a game by Mattel. Uh, they actually came out with a skipper board game, and I wonder if this is what the actual board looks like. I have no proof because I don't know the game, but in one of the uh, Barbie books that I have, I saw an advertisement for it, which I think is kind of cool. But it, a cross-promotional thing, that would be very popular, of course. And they definitely did do stuff like that. So this piece just flares out like that. It sits. That's the actual desk. Put that there. Lamp would normally go on the little tiny table, but we don't have that because it is currently needs to be, needing to be fixed. So we'll put the lamp and the table back there. And then we've got the bed with all the rest of the accessories in it for setup. So let's open that up and take a look at those again. Like, I'm actually going to catalog everything that came with this thing this time. Um, something else that I'm not seeing on here is there are a bunch of little tiny... Oh, no, there are bowls. There, there are some bows on here. Okay. Because it had little cut out, cut in place buttons and stuff that you put on it. And this, these are little bows. They just... They had little uh, Mattel sew free strips and you just kind of glued them on. That's really cool, I think. Okay, there's all the things. So here's the bed mattress cover. Goes underneath, and that's the top of the mattress. It's got little flared edges. That is adorable. I love the little sew free thing on it. This particular glue is coming off, though, so we'll have to re glue that too. Bed can go right here, I guess. Kind of in frame where everybody can see it. So the portraits, they go on the wall. I only had one in there last time, so this time I'll actually put them all in. Just randomly throw them in. It was done like this so that little girls could decorate the room. TV. A little vent on the back of the TV. It looks like it was a portable one because it actually has a handle on it, which... Well, how luxe is that? My goodness. A waste basket. Telephone. That's actually kind of cute. I love how it pops up in 3D. Uh, bedboard. Hello, sweetheart. My cat's going to interject in a moment, it looks like. Hello there. A record. This is Dick Dale of the Summer Surf. Really cute little pillows that uh, are needing to be re glued. Here comes the cat. Yep, right in the video. Oh, honey, you can't sit right in the middle of it. She's like, I'm just going to take over right here. Here, you want to be in video? Here we go. There's Cinnamon, everyone. She wanted to be a part of the video. Now you can sit next to me while I talk, okay? Can you be good? I uh, forgot to put on the mattress cover. Oh, uh, these little buttons, they're supposed to fit through, and then they add the corner, so I guess I should do that because I don't think any of them are actually still through it. Some of them are. Oh, mine won't stay. There we go. Yeah, it adds a little flare to the corner so it should lay properly. Ah, oh, cool. I didn't notice that last time I opened it. <laughs> There's the cat attacking the window. I don't know if you saw her. Oh, no. No, no, no. <laughs> cat attack! <laughs> oh, God. Not this $200 vintage cardboard, sweetheart. So that flares kind of on the box. And then that goes on top. There we go. So we've got the curtain here, which the rod fits or should fit. And the other curtain. So let's go ahead and put that on since I've got it in my hand at the moment. You are such a crazy kitty, my goodness. Sorry, this is not an exciting... Oh, there she is again. Where did, what are you doing with my playset? It's mine because it's in the house, clearly. Silly cat. Can't wait to be a part of everything. Hope you guys like my cat. Hope you like seeing her investigate. <laughs> I'm sure this was a common occurrence for many little girls or boys, maybe, if they had this set. Or heck, even if you had like a regular play set. This is my first Siamese cat. I never knew. I mean, I had an idea that they were kind of 
kind of fun nut so but this one really is uh, quite out there but I wouldn't trade it for anything she's fine hey 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 stop that no attacking my stuff no don't do that there we go hopefully that'll stay without the cat attacking it but that's cute it's got a little fabric window display right there with little paws coming through after it, of course, because she wants to get me. This is a very big playset, and I'm going to have to do quite a bit of skipper videos and upload them over time so that we don't lose everything, I think. Put the lamp back up. I'm not a big fan of this uh, wall on the side over here. I keep bumping it. All right, let's continue. Let's throw the pillows in places where they'll show up. There, put that over there, I guess. Put this one over here so Barbie and Skipper have a nice place to sit. Here's a nice Barbie portrait so you don't forget what your sister looks like. <laughs> and also, she's on TV. Came with a little doll which has a little bend on it so it'll sit properly. It's made out of cardboard, it's not made out of fabric like the other So Free pieces. Little rag doll, it's cute. We've got the Music Man soundtrack, which was very popular in the 1960s. The Beach Boys. <laughs> oh, yeah, and I love the Beach Boys. I grew up listening to those, and that was certainly not the time period for it. A SETI seat. Where does this go? Uh, here, perhaps. I don't think so, but I'm going to put it there just because I think it goes in the back up against the wall, maybe. I have no idea. We'll go back to that later, I guess. This is part of the new Barbie dream house setup because it comes with her. She has her own little dollhouse, of course. Birdcage, which we can't set up yet because it's not working. Here's more portraits to set up. I'm not showing up in frame. There's that. Turn it just to make sure. A daisy. <laughs> Flowers were very popular in the 60s. You know, that's where flower power came from. Come on. Oh, dear. There. Come on. Skipper needs her portrait. And there's one more, which is right here. I, a little girl. No idea who that is. Sorry, I didn't know you were so crooked. Yeah. Well, we're gonna have to make do. Not an ideal setup, all of this. We've got some Barbie travel stuff. I, I have the Barbie in Switzerland outfits and I love them. They're actually some of my favorite, or Barbie in Holland. They're some of my favorite outfits. So I'm excited to have those and show them off eventually. We'll just throw all the records. The Beatles, oh yeah, the Beatles. A cat something. A triangle pillow. Okay, well you can sit there I guess. And a record player. There you go, record playing. And we got two more records. We've got Peter and Gordon, A World Without Love. And the Beach Boys, Surfer Girl. Yeah, nice set. Oh, one more, one more. Donna Lynn, my boyfriend got a Beatle haircut. Oh, how unfortunate for him. <laughs> I guess you don't like that Beatle hair. Maybe you do. I have no idea how the dream house is supposed to get set up, so let's just kind of figure it out. It's got a D here. It's got a C here, so I guess this folds over. Thank God it's labeled, my goodness. A. And B. And E and F.
There we go. So, okay, that's her dream house setup. <laughs> I guess you just imagine the rest of it. Barbie's new dream house, which I do not own the actual larger size. I will eventually one day get that because we're going to need it for some of the setups. No idea what this is for. Maybe it's for putting with the living room setup or something. Like that. I don't know. Well, so she's got her dollhouse. There you are. And the rest of it is now all actually set up with everything that came with it. Seti, closet, portraitures, bed. Right there, bed with all, everything on it except Skipper. The little alcove, which is very cute. I like the alcove a lot. Haven't figured out the seti. This piece right here, it goes into, oh, there's two pieces. Well, that explains more. They must go 13 and 13. Hmm. There's also an extra piece on the outside over here, which I haven't figured out where that is supposed to be yet. No, I don't think that's right. Or maybe it is. Who the heck knows? <laughs> so yeah, there's Barbie's dream, uh, Barbie's dream house, Skipper's dream room set up. I will see if I can't get, uh, I got Skipper right here again to push in it. But that's all the stuff that came with my particular version of it. And look at that. That is, it's quite the setup right there. That is a very nice little room. I'll see if I can't get a tripod set up at this exact moment and then I can start dressing up some skipper outfits. I have some very cute skipper fashions that I like and I can't wait to show them off. So uh, until next time, this is Jazz Hands. Hope you enjoyed this incomplete skipper dream room setup.